So it's always important to be inspired, but unfortunately as an artist, sometimes it's impossible. <laughs> so here's some thoughts on that. So look, I have found myself over the past year like struggling with this like everything going on in the world, the business is crazy and like everything's going good and bad and I've had, you know, had a major loss in my family and just being inspired to do artwork and finding my space, you know, typically you know, nature really inspires me and it still does. And I have done a lot of um, looking for other artists that inspire me in their work and like I found a couple people like Aaron Blaze does this really amazing stuff and I bought some of his classes and that's been really fun on my personal journey as an artist. So I think, you know, just helping people find inspiration, I think really looking for the things in the world that you get excited about and trying to infuse some of that into your art. And I think another aspect is really finding other artists whose work is really cool, especially ones that put out tutorials and training stuff and jumping into what they do. And then you'll, you'll find yourself seeing them do it like, oh, that's, that's really not as complicated. Oh, I see how they did that. Oh, what if I did that? And then like your brain goes off to the races and it's a really beautiful thing. For me this past year, they're like, the biggest thing I've been inspired by is NFTs and the crypto space and trying to marry all that together. Now I'm working on this project I've kind of leaked out a few times um, called Cleantha Studios, which is me collaborating with my dad post-mortem, uh, taking his artwork, digitally remastering it and releasing it as NFTs on the blockchain. And that's like where all my, my personal creative juices have been going lately, which has been a lot of fun. And uh, I hope you guys check that out. And I'd uh, love to hear what inspires you creatively. Like, let's talk. Let's love to kind of get some little nuggets from everybody else. So, peace.